Hey guys, I'm Lynn Gilmartin for Poker News at the 2010 Aussie Millions Poker Championship. Today is day 1C of the $1,100 opening event. We've already got 380 players registered for today. We've got 10 minute call until it all starts and the line is absolutely huge. So this event combined with day 1A and B is well on its way to exceeding the estimated $1 million prize pool. Now this is a repercharge event which means that everyone we lost on day 1A and B have the opportunity to buy it back in today. And with a little bit of a tweak, we can also have some fresh faces for this day 1C of the Ripper Charge. Now yesterday for day 1B, we had about 30 players more than day 1A, with 357 players. Yet at the end of the day yesterday, only 60 of those survived. Now last year's main event champion, Stuart Scott, was within that field. He didn't survive the whole day, but we did catch up with him earlier on to see how it felt to return as the champion. I feel good this year. I feel like I did last year, so um, that's all I can do is you know, play my best and see what happens. Yeah. But yesterday wrapped up with Jim Master Rakos taking the chip lead with 175,000 in chips. He's followed by Dean MacGyver on 156,000 and Kerry Stead with 132,000 in chips. Now all the players have taken their seats, the cards are in the air so make sure you stay tuned to the live reporting section as always for all of the action here from the opening event. And if you have a Twitter account then make sure you follow us on at PokerNews underscore live and you can get all of the action straight to your Twitter. I'm Lynn Gilmartin for PokerNews.com.